Oh, welcome again. So I'm going to give you a report, a progress report here. Uh, in this video, you can see that we have completed uh, the lake repair work. As you can see, that we have installed all the rocks on the safety bed. Before, in my initial video, when I uploaded for the for the same uh, lake. So there were a lot of splits on both sides, left and right. And those were around about 20 to 22 splits in this lake. And uh, uh, there was uh, water loss, a huge water loss in this lake uh, from those splits. And um, there were there are two losses to, uh, of water. One is from evaporation, second is the deep percolation, or you can say infiltration. And uh, we were facing a big problem in this lake. So, uh, because a lot of electricity and uh, were required to fill uh, the lake and to keep the level at the required uh, level. So, we have emptied this lake and uh, then we repair all these sheets. You can see that this dark black color sheet is the new one that we have installed. And that one is the old one where you have the markings which, which are showing the water levels. So you can see that that was the water level. It was dropped from here to there. And uh, each season we were facing problem. So now that is repaired. And uh, for safety purpose we put the stones also. So what was the cost of repair this lake? It is about uh, one... 16 million is the, the lake liner and uh, almost 6 million is the rocks so there is around about you can say uh, 22 million uh, park rupees is the cost of repairing this one lake so the stones which we put here the purpose of these stones is not only the aesthetic view but to hold the sheet here and there is no slippage of the sheet under there in the lake. Plus, um, that is uh, provide you a uh, stepping area that you can come down up to your bed, uh, safety bed. Uh, because this sheet is very slippery, if you uh, keep a step there, then you will fall down there. So, it's very slippery. So what we have done, we have put there a main big rock, then the medium size and then the small size. So there are three to four rocks that we have placed in this, on these sides. So here you can see, big, medium, small, small, small and then these are the rocks. So overall look, uh, this lake is almost complete. The rubbish, or you can say the accumulated soil that is sitting under there in the bed, which is about, uh, you can say, 12 inches deep. I'm not going to uh, pull that out because it's a big job and I don't have the time to do that. Uh, the second thing is, uh, as we are uh, doing the construction work and we are renovating, you're not renovating, we are actually dismantling, you can say, uh, the golf course and then we are rebuilding it uh, as per new design so we have a lot to do here so i don't have the time to do that uh, type of jobs so once i finished uh, I mean, last night we received rain so today i'm not working on lake edge that is for safety and uh, once it is firm and i can work again then we will start here again and we will uh, try to push the soil right to the uh, where the, our rocks are starting. So we have here some sand also sitting in that sand. You can see we have grassy material and there are roots uh, of grass. So th that uh, sand will also go on top of it here, not on top of the uh, rocks, but before that it will end up right there and this grass will grow further on and uh, we will have the grassy edges then finally 
so hopefully everything will go on and uh, everything will be better by end of the day so thank you for watching please subscribe the channel like the videos if you want to know more about the golf course construction and landscape maintenance and construction thank you